the charge on the header is gone now the five dollars was part of the header that is gone because you didn't select the keep checkbox however when i go back and select the financial menu on the line you can indeed see the charge of the line stayed that is the power of the keep checkbox you keep charging the customer in multiple delivery but if you don't select the keep you just charge them the whole amount once and that's it so if you have multiple delivery would you like to charge the whole thing in one shot or would you like to prorate it and charge it frequently so now if i carry on and demonstrate the rest of it let's go ahead and say i'm going to pack up the rest of it and i continue with this demo let's say i like to just get the rest all it actually changes the quantity as you see i've already deducted two out of five so now you have three on the first line two on the second one i can cancel that up if i like to i can indeed place the order on hold i'm not going to pack it just yet maybe the customer has called me and said there's something wrong with my order don't send me anything more so i can now use this new feature and create a new order on hold which has been a new feature in r3 and higher i create a new line and i create a hold code i go to the view details and now i can create a hold code i give it a specific code so Say customer concern or C hold whatever I like to put in and then I can associate a role to identify that specific individual who is a member of that role that can remove the hold so nobody else can deal with that sales order hypothetically that could be a sales manager as you see there's a list of roles that may be limited to this particular document or may not these are all system security roles that are available now I associate the account receivable clerk I associate the color coding here to show the hold line item for me and then I click close. Needless to say, you could remove the inventory reservation on that hold. So while you had any reservation, as soon as you put it on hold, you may want to remove the reservation. Now I check this out and I can say for how many days should I put it on hold? Maybe one day, maybe two days. What is the checkout date? Let's say is the whole date is today. Checkout date could be today or any other date that perhaps you have in mind. And as you see right now, if I wanted to clear the hold, I have no capability. Even though I'm an administrator, but I'm not a member of accounts receivable clerk. So let's go ahead and learn how to add somebody into a specific security role. I minimize this form. First of all, let's refresh the sales order. And as you see on the hold column, there's a yellow triangle. That means this specific sales order is on hold. Let's try to do the packing anyways and not pay attention to the hold. If I click on packing, the packing has been disabled. I can't even invoice it. The order is on hold, so I can't do anything.